What's going on guys? I'm gonna show you a quick way to access your SSD if it's not showing up. So I'm on a Windows 7 computer. This should work for Windows 8 and 10 as well. Go ahead and come on down here to the Windows box, check that up. And once that is clicked, you're gonna see the little search bar below it. Go ahead and type in disk, D-I-S-K space, M. You probably won't even have to spell the whole entire thing out. And then you're going to see probably your third one, create and format a hard disk partition. Now, if you do not see that, find your disk management and it's going to be the same thing. So this is what we want. This popped up right up here. And this is my disk management. I'm going to go ahead and expand this a little bit so we can see what we're looking at here. Now off camera, I've already looked at this so I know exactly which one is which. The reason why my SSD is not showing up, it's a one terabyte and I have 953.79 which is my one terabyte one right there. It does not have an associated letter to it. So all my other hard drives have a letter F, C, E. I even have one up there, D. And as we can see here, the one terabyte does not have any letter to it. Sorry, just easier with my phone instead of screen capture. So once you have identified which one is which, we're gonna go ahead and hover right over my one terabyte we're gonna right click it and we're gonna go ahead and go to change drive letter and path. This little box is gonna come up. We don't have G yet, so let's go ahead and hit add. And what we're gonna do here is we are gonna assign the following letter. We're gonna click that down to, where did G go? I guess my computer already has a G somewhere or maybe, yeah, maybe. Anyway, we're gonna choose H. Doesn't really matter to be honest with you. Now we're gonna go ahead and hit okay. And now my RAV power has H, yay, finally. And it has it right up here as well. So now we're gonna double test this. We're gonna come down to our windows. We're gonna click on that like we would normally, go to computer and bada bing, bada boom. And now it is showing right here, that's Absolutely fantastic. Super pumped on that one. And now we can use my SSD hard drive. Well, thanks guys so much for watching the video. Hopefully it has helped you hit that thumbs up button. And if you guys are looking for other SSDs, I'll have some links in the description box below. Thank you so much. Subscribe on your way out. Take care. Bye-bye. Don't let the party stop, guys. Hit one of these videos, continue to watch, and we'll see you soon.